Even that bread is sexy. Like, I'm ready for this. Yo, so I almost walked a mile for that cheesesteak. Look at that. No wonder they have all these shuttles that I'm not going to take. Alright, so my review of the Tony Luke's cheesesteak. Original cheesesteak. We just got it with onions and we just got it with provolone cheese. So this looks like a beauty. Perfect shaped bread, perfect cut. Big ribbons of meat, provolone cheese, gooey, melted. It looks perfect. So yeah, this is like the meatiest cheese that I've probably had before. Like each bite, yeah, it's like almost like a steak, but it's just chopped up, man. That's what it's called, a cheese steak. But it was super fulfilling. The bread was like had a nice exterior, uh, kind of um, softer on the inside, which I like. It wasn't too hard. Towards the edges, it was a little bit tough, which, but that wasn't the whole thing. Uh, but I really appreciate this bread. It's like probably the perfect bread for the sandwich. Um, everything flowed together. The onions were a little lighter than I wanted or like, or was used to, but that's fine. It's just a color thing. It doesn't um, change the taste. It was a nice sweet onions that really came through and really, um, enhance the meat and the cheese so the only thing that's not making this the best cheesesteak i've ever had is the salt factor and seasoning factor if there was just a little bit more salt a little bit more of the seasonings elevated it would probably be the best one i've ever had uh, penn station still holds that um, number one trophy in my hand because it's so flavorful the bread's perfect as well as cheesy but this is going to be a close two, but if, if I went back there and seasoned it myself, I think it would probably take the cake as number one. My favorite part of the sandwich was how thick and meaty it was. Uh, it was just so fulfilling, like, this is a sandwich. But my least favorite part was the, the lack of salt factor. So it was probably definitely worth the .7 mile walk I did to get it. I'm satisfied. I enjoyed it. I'm glad I got to experience it because last time I was here, I went to Pat's and it probably wasn't even close to this or Penn Station. But Tony Luke's is probably the second best cheese stick I've ever had. Probably the best Philly because I guess it's the the OG Philly since I'm in Philly. But second, if we're going to the whole realm of cheesecake.